Welcome back to Character Select. I'm Saban. This is KOTOR 2. And I think I only have one planet left to go through. We are also officially just over 20 hours into this playthrough on my uh, actual game data, which means probably closer to 25 considering how much uh, time I've lost dying or fucking up uh, my recordings. I'm already at that location. Right, no, I'm going to Korriban. Yeah. Jesus, that's much louder than it usually is. Rainbow? No, that's just lens flare. It's gonna say I'd be amazed if Corvan ever had anything pretty on it. We've hit the ground. This is Corvan. Why would one of the Jedi you're looking for come here? It seems quiet. Just the wind. But deep beneath the surface, you can feel the pain of what took place here. There is great power in this place, for those who can hear its call. There is much that would draw a Jedi to this place. The resting grounds of the ancient and more recently departed Sith contain many teachings believed lost. The most likely place to find our lost Jedi is the ruins of the old academy. So what happened here? It was said that Revan intended to return to Korriban to subdue any potential Sith insurgents, but Revan disappeared. It took a year or two for the Republic to send a force here to deal with any Sith that may have remained. They found Korriban much as we have, barren and lifeless. It was assumed that the remnants of the Sith turned on each other, vying for what little power remained. The Republic found evidence that several Sith lords escaped Korriban, fleeing to remote sections of the galaxy. <sighs> Let's head out then. If you walk Korriban's surface, you shall walk it without me. I didn't want your company anyway. I will remain here and meditate. Our link remains. I shall contact you and provide guidance when needed. The Academy is on the other side of this valley. Be careful. Dark energy fills these ruins, and even the fallen Sith live still. Yeah. Please don't call me with advice. Thanks. Alright. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's see. I'm going to take Atten. And I gotta take HK forty seven. Yeah. Is this the party configuration I want? No, I'd really like to have another Jedi, but whatever. We'll deal with it. Man, what a shithole. The structures you see around you are the plundered tombs of the ancient Sith Lords. Each tomb was once infused with the history and heritage of the old Sith Empire, containing great mysteries and powerful relics of the Force. However, even the many traps could not long hold back the curious, the fools, and the weak. And so these tombs fell, spilling their secrets into the hands of those unable to comprehend or preserve them. Good riddance. All right, everybody, brace start. yourselves. It's time to level up ATA 47 like 14 plus times. Okay, uh... HK-47's upgrade path is fucking trash, but whatever, we'll make it work. 
The broken corpses before you are all that remain of the Sith on Korriban. I doubt there is much to be gained from looting these bodies. It would be best to leave them be. Suck my force using dick, Kraya. Fool! You've disturbed the spirits of this place, and they have sent their guardians. Oh. <laughs> Hisses are enough to humble even an arrogant one such as. The fuck is a hisses? Oh, whatever. Team Moon Slash Korea. Don't even care. More where that came from. More where that came from. Optimal. Accuracy ratio achieved. Alright, important question. Does heal heal droids? It does. Okay, I'm just. Bye, HK 47. I'm just gonna go back on the ship. Hey! See, Kraya? I told you it was a great idea. Fuck these corpses. Get me a goddamn level up. Sneak attack 2, sweet. Uh, let's see, what am I even doing here? Okay, yeah, just all those. Give me, give me all the skills. God, I'm, I have so many force powers. Oh god. Uh, first person. That just to spell magic. Me. I guess sure. I'll do that. Kind of underwhelming, but whatever. Ah, uh, HK-47. I did not realize that you still existed, especially now that the other generations are activated. Query, what is it you wish, that one? I see that your recent reassembly has not affected your behavior core, nor your attitude. Wow. Statement. If I require a similar diagnostic in the future, I shall seek out the Iridonian. Oh, I do not think so. There is much work that needs to be done first. Statement. My memory core has suffered some damage. Statement. Yet somehow, a gap in my circuits makes me feel as if I should remember you. Statement. This is all the more important since during my routine inspection of all potential escape routes from this vessel, I made an interesting discovery. Observation. The Nava computer is voice locked. As a consequence, you are now responsible for course corrections and astrogation. Statement. That is indeed a great burden. It also raises many questions. Query, why would someone lock the Nava computer? Answer, presumably to hide where one has been. Statement, I believe this ship has been somewhere. Somewhere you wish to keep him. Holy shit, T3. Hardcore, little dude. Okay. Well. That was unexpected. Alright, Visus and... Yeah, let's keep Atten on the team for now. Let's settle this. Don't rob the grave saving. You'll aggravate the guardian saving. It was a great idea. Everything is great. Suck my god. Evil witch. 400 XP a pop.
A Zabrak blaster pistol, huh? Speed 18 versus 4 to 11. Plus 3 attack, though. No, nope, that's just inferior to the Mandalorian Ripper in every way. Okay. Came from. See, Kraya, it's great. Everything is great. I'm not even looting these bodies for the gear, I, I just want the XP. More where that came from. Yeah. Stupid dragon thing. Ah, what's that stench? Listen. The wind from the cave tells of great power within, recently awakened. Yes, a great powerful stench. There is great power and dark energy within this cave. I would advise you to finish your explorations within the academy before venturing into the cave. Well, you know what that means. We're gonna go in the cave. But first, let's uh, just save the game real quick. Just in case for once the old witch was not out of her mind. The Shirek oh, cave, huh? From. Uh huh, yep, I'm real scared. Whatever. Don't care. I shall make this one see. Where that came from? Where that came from? Soon I shall know pain. To cut a huh? To battle. A weakness is revealed. You are no match for us. No, I'm dealing out that kind of damage, you ain't. More where that came from. More where that came from. I guess there's no Sithrak here. Ooh. Yeah, I have a feeling I need to stock up on medical supplies before the uh, end game here. Because I am a little low. Not gonna lie. Fine. Fine. Save against my force powers. See if I care. I'll just chop you into Soon pieces. What is going on over there? More where that came from. from. Oh, I actually missed. Must have rolled a one. This is 
revealed. How may I? Let's see, what force powers do you have unlocked already? I guess, yeah, force choke seems alright. And Atten skills. Boop, 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 boop. Sir. Underwhelming levels. See, this is why I like Saga Edition more. You got something interesting every level there. Or at least something. It's a s'more shith issue do whatever's. His seeths. Whoa, Visas, please. You are no match for us. Oh, those are those are Sith assassins. Oh, okay. Sure, why not? Good job, team. Where that came from? A weakness is revealed. <laughs> Whatever, nerds. The power I felt coming through the cave is just ahead. I believe you are strong enough to explore the tomb ahead. You will have to face the challenges of this tomb alone. Are you ready? What? Uh, okay. Sure, why not? Hello, Do you hear Aang. The words of the Jedi Council: the Republic will fall if we do not act now. Already, the Mandalorians have taken three systems along the rim. They will only grow more powerful with time. Come, stand with me. We will use our might to help the Republic in its time of need. Join Revan and I. Together, we will battle this menace. Hmm, this is a, just a test. All this is a, just a test. All life is a test. And sometimes the student can be a teacher, too. You know it, even now. The Jedi Council is wise, but will take too long to deal with this threat. We must act now to stop the Mandalorians. I have heard of you. Your masters speak well of you, of your skills in battle. Join us. Hmm. I joined without hesitation against the wishes of the Council. The Jedi Council is wise, but can make mistakes. History has proven this time and time again. Yep. The Council seems content to watch, to debate, while entire systems fall to the Mandalorians. If we don't act now, there may be no Republic army to assist in the future. I sense you will join us. What are your reasons? Hmm. I couldn't sit by while so many suffered. A good reason. Delay would have brought ruin, and there was much suffering. You had to act. It was within our power to end the war. And the Council chose to debate behind closed doors, while planets burned. Hmm. I think they were making a mistake. We barely won the war, and just in time. Yes, that's right. Without us, the Republic would have been no more. And the Council? Their vaunted wisdom, bred only 
in action. And that would have led to destruction greater than anything born of the dark side. So, if you could do it all again, the real question is, would you? The Mandalorians await on the edge of space, eager to crush the Republic. You know how this turns out. Would you do it any different, knowing what it costs you? Knowing what it costs the rest? <laughs> I wouldn't do anything differently. My choices made me the person I am today. So knowing all that would transpire, would you still follow Revan and I? Excellent. Wait, Bastila? And now you are all alone. Would you join me now? You didn't follow Revan and I down our path. Join us. Your journey hasn't ended yet. Wait, Bastila didn't join you. She warned us all to obey the council. She didn't join us that day. But in time, she came to our way of thinking. And even before then, she wavered and wondered what would have happened. It is a familiar path. There were those who wished to follow you to war, yet remain behind. They came to hate you for the choices they wished to make. <laughs> well, I didn't follow you then, and I certainly won't now. Are you so certain? Every step along the way, we did what we thought was right. Perhaps the same path lays before you. But the time of words are done. Now it is time you experienced the full power of the dark side. Tavwan Isan, Karaga Sin, Nisotza, Zaysit Terra. Does someone just mash their dick on a keyboard to make up these names? Like, what the shit? Alright, let's cut down the chaff. Alright. Let's actually turn on our shields. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Uh... There, take that. The final attack did not kill you, but the faint of the... You feel the taint of the dark side coursing through you. I feel weak, like I lost a part of myself. No response. Pray it doesn't answer. Oh, what the shit? Holy crap, that is a lot of dark side points I just got. Uh, okay. Sure, that was a bit of an unfair fight, but whatever. my lightsaber form here because I don't think I'm going to be God, we've got don'ts and powers. And I don't think I'm going to be fighting any people with blaster bolts. So let's see. Do, 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 do. Attack, damage, save. I think contention's probably gonna be my best bet going forward here. Fight me, you ugly brain faced bastard.
cool. facing in here other than that, but uh, if that's any indication, this place is kind of bullshit. But I'm sure that's fine, right? It's totally expected for everything to be poor shit at this level. Because uh, if you haven't heard my rant before, I am firmly of the opinion that D&D 3.x, which this is based on, pretty much breaks down after like level 11. So, playing at what is this? Level 22 is a little outside of uh, what this game is going to be good at. But hey, it could prove me wrong. That could have just been a badly balanced fight. Uh... I guess that was the way I came in. Yeah, suck a 60 damage hit. Nothing to it. Blown out data pad. Uh, let's see. Sneak past the Sheriff Green Grounds. There's order to lock the door and await the return. Yeah, huh? Huh. Okay, yeah, this this isn't nearly as bad of a situation as I thought it was gonna be. Jesus. I do a disgusting amount of damage. Like, I know I keep saying it, but so goddamn. Also, these things have a disgusting amount of health. Good lord. That's well over 150 points of damage. I did in one turn there. But, you know, that's, that's fine and normal at this level. I suppose. I'm going to switch to power attacking. Because... Oh, uh, no, that's much less effective. Never mind. Get knocked down, son. The one damage, though. Sorry if I'm being a little uh, less than talkative during these fights, but I mean, this is really just press one to win a lot. Yep. Okay. Fucking waste of goddamn time. I still don't see why they put fights like that in this game. Oh good, more horrible dark side energy. I'm just gonna save the game again here. Uh, no, I want to save in a new slot. Because I'm not sure I like where this is going. Especially with this few force points. Uh, hello. Com says we've lost another heavy droid transport. How can we break through the Mandalorian lines without support? The path is mined and the place crawling with enemies. 
I know we've got our orders to press forward, but we're at quarter strength. We can't, General. It's impossible. We need to retreat. We had to charge. Our forces were fully committed. We would either win the battle or lose the war. There was no choice. But we won't help by throwing our lives away to storm the path. Too many Mandalorians. Too few of us. We already lost half the men just getting to the path. They've got the rest of the company pinned down by the crash site. You can't possibly ask the troops to go forward. If you ask us to charge, will it make a difference? Will our sacrifice mean something? Only Revan can answer that. Even afterwards, no one could piece together exactly what happened. We won, though. We, we will press forward if you ask it. The path is mined. If you ask us to charge, there will be losses, General. I stand by my decision. At the time, it was the right thing to do. I'll tell the men, General. Everyone, you heard the general. Charge! Charge! <laughs> Just gonna let those dudes die. Oh, we are so out of force points, that's right. See, you're fine. You just are a little exploded. Oh, okay. Sure, why not? See? It's fine. Everything is a-okay. So speedy. Hey, I got all my force points back. Cool. shields. Also a physical boost package. So this is strength 2, fort 1. This is con strength dax plus 1. What are my stats right now? Yeah, I need, I need to keep that the way it is. I do not want to lose a point of strength modifier. I got crit. And then I just undid all of the damage. See, fights like this are why Mass Effect 2's system of just awarding experience based on goals exclusively was such a good idea. Like, it's, there's just no point in fighting a single Sith Rack other than, give me my XP, son. Neblish's data pad. <laughs> the visions, the visions, the visions. Okay. Uh, hello. Uh. 
And I'll just edit, undo all the damage I just took there. Thank you. Is that Kraya? Yep. You are to be commended for making it this far. Um, hello? If you knew of a shortcut to get here, why didn't you just tell me, you silly old bitch? You've revisited the dark moments of your past, and now you must face the present. <sighs> what do you mean? Your confusion is natural. The others and I will help you understand. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Get away from her. She's a dark Hi, Jedi. Hi, Adam. Where did you come from? Literally. Atten, I've had enough of your snide contempt. Uh... Kreia, calm down. I will protect myself from this foul-mouthed ruffian. Hey, what's the commotion here? Stay out of this, Beodor. This is a personal dispute between Atten and myself. You're threatening Atten with a lightsaber, and I'm supposed to just stay out of it? No. Why do I even bother? Hi, T3. The three of you would challenge me? You sorely underestimate the power of the Force. Think again, Kreia. Your dark influence will end. Your friends are all arrayed against me. Will you stand for this? Yes. Fuck you, you old witch. My friends are right, Kreia. You've been manipulating me from the very beginning. You, of all people, would judge me so. Am I not worthy of redemption? <laughs> no. No. Prepare to die. Oh my god. Fuck. Stupid goddamn game. <sighs> okay. You have left me an opening! Oh, you actually are all just visions. Alright. <sighs> Whatever. I have lost a lot of light side points. Whatever. Fucking game! Uh, hi there. Why are you here? Okay, uh... Hi, buddy. You've succeeded in this trial. I am impressed. Was I supposed to learn something from this? Sometimes, a momentary insight is worth lifetimes of experience. You may not yet understand what you learned here. That wisdom will come in the future. I don't know, Kreia. I feel this tomb has changed me, and not for the better. You overestimate the power of the tomb. Any change you feel is coming from within yourself. Instinctually, you know your true path. Trust in your feelings. They will lead you in conquering the many challenges that the future holds for you. I'm ready to leave. The room you are in. You should be able to unlock a passage that leads outside the tomb. Cool, lightsaber. Ancient sarcophagus. Ludo crushes war sword. Huh. 
no besies. Well, let's check this shit out. Ludo crushes armband. Aw, oh, god damn it. Fine. See, what's my constitution right now? Hey! Oh no, that's... That's with the armband on, god damn it. I guess... Uh, I'll just put that on. I'll tell you about this war sword. Let's see, 2 to 16, plus 2 dark side, blah 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 blah. That's a double sword, right? Oh, okay. Well. Yeah, I'm not really feeling it. It's my pimp sword. Actually, no, I wanted to have the, uh, what was it, the Sith Tremor sword and my vibr lightsaber. Yay. Mom. Sure, I'll just take drugs from the ancient tomb. Why not? Video games, everybody. Okay, and the random Sith tomb just contains a machine gun. Cool, cool. To the Shirek cave. Hello, friends. Friends, where where are you? Oh God, I'm so alone. So alone. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and we will uh, see you next time as I crawl my way out of this cave without any companions, I guess. Uh, so thank you all very much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and all that jazz, and I'll see you next week.